Ready, aim, fire! What's up everybody, Zachary Strife here, and we are finally doing some Elite Dangerous. Uh, what you saw there in the beginning was what not to do, and uh, that was pretty much my first experience when I first launched the game. Um, I'm going to go ahead and give you a quick and dirty controls tweak thingy that you need to do to make sure that that doesn't happen to you. Um, and we'll go into the tutorials to explain that, because online is sometimes dodgy. Um, so... Elite Dangerous is a space trading, space pirating, super awesome game. Like, I, I can't even begin to explain it. Uh, but we're going to go through and, first of all, fix your controls. So I go, I went ahead and loaded into the training. Um, so I'll show you what happened and why this is an issue. When you first launch the game, it gives you the default controls of... Uh, mouse and keyboard where the mouse is the roll. Uh, basically, whatever direction this arrow in the middle is pointing is which way you're going to roll. And that's a big problem for many, many reasons. Uh, and I will show you. Even just lifting off here, I just start rolling. Even though it looks like I'm in the middle of the screen, I'm rolling. So, how do you fix this? It's actually quite simple. Uh, we'll go ahead and level out here. Go into our controls options, or you hit escape options, go to your controls, and then you're going to want to change your X access to yaw, and you want to add roll left to A, and roll right to D. That's all. That's all you got to do to make this game way more playable. Now when I move my mouse, you can see I go left and right, and A and D is your roll. Why this isn't the default, I have no idea, but that's what it should be. Um, so now the ship becomes way more control, or you get way more control of your ship. And it's just a general better experience. Um, people probably can do the roll, but when I first played, I was just fucking spinning and spinning and spinning, and I just couldn't stop, and I couldn't get it. Why? Uh, I don't remember where I saw that. Uh, there was a tutorial. Or a, uh, a player, a new player guide that explained it to me. Um, can't remember. I can't credit them, I guess, because I can't remember. Uh, but I found it on the forums, and that's the very first thing you should do with this game, to be completely honest. Um, I really haven't been playing a whole lot since this game still is in beta, uh, but I have been practicing with the controls and get everything down. And, uh, yeah, that's about where I'm at right now. Um, go ahead and leave the station here. I'm actually doing the very first tutorial. So, once you leave the station, it should give you updated information. It should. Yep, there we go. This game is remarkable, and I can't even explain why. Uh... Quest docking. Okay, so there's a lot of different things you need to do to uh, be able to dock into stations. Uh, but first of all, I'm going to go over the very simple controls. Um, to Since you just switched it to roll, it's A and D. Uh, yaw is left and right. Pitch is up and down. Very simple stuff. I believe that's how the controls should be to start. Um, to throttle up, not throttle forward, but throttle up is R. And then to throttle downwards is F and then uh, W and S are your throttle up, throttle down X is zero throttle and that's about it for the very basic controls uh, but let's go ahead and request docking to do that you hit one or you can look to your left you can either look or hit one so that's the looking method that's one uh, the HUD uh, controls are a little confusing at first. You actually use Q and E to go through the tabs on the top, and then W A S D to navigate the tab that you're in. Uh, for a while there, I couldn't figure that out. Like it, it's just the controls are very different. 
So uh, we want to contact the training station, so we'll hit spacebar, request docking. Okay, and it says it's in the very bottom middle above the radar there. Proceed to landing pad 6. And we have 9 minutes and 50 seconds. Um, if you don't park within that time, uh, the station has a uh, timer that will tell you to get out of the station if you're in it. And if you don't get it out within a certain amount of time, they will begin firing upon you, which I think is a little cruel, but it's the rules of the the galaxy, I guess, right? Now, the very first thing you guys want to do is definitely hit these tutorials. Um, practice them until you go on, before you go online, because there's a lot of a lot of learning curve here. I need to put my landing down, so L, which they just changed. That was used to be uh, insert, but they just changed it. So L is now the landing key. And then uh, Q and E are actually side strafe. Yeah, so I just got a fine for going over top of another pad. Yeah, that's another thing you gotta watch out for. You'll actually get fined for parking on top of other pads. Uh, so be careful about that. Since this is a multiplayer game, they don't want you to litter or loiter. So that's the reasoning behind not parking on top of pads that you're not assigned to. Anyway, that was the very first tutorial. Very simple, very quick controls. And hopefully you guys can play the game and, and enjoy it now that you have better keyboard and mouse control. I mean, that is the very first thing I, I recommend to anybody is to switch the roll to A and D and to switch the yaw to your left and right mouse. So anyway, guys, that's a very quick and dirty tutorial. Uh, I will be doing more very shortly, probably immediately after this video. But uh, hope you guys enjoy. hope this information helps you a lot because it does. Uh, provide a much better experience. But anyway, I'm Zachary Strife, a barely adequate gamer, and I'm signing out.